Hello everyone and welcome back to this lesson dedicated to emergency plans for cultural heritage institutions. In this specific part, we will talk about this uh, um, particular case study of the realization of a risk assessment project and the drawing up of an emergency plan for the Museum in Bolzano, Italy. And this is a project on which Matilab is currently um, working on. Here are the contents of our lesson. Okay, so let's start with a brief introduction of the museum. Uh, the Museum is the contemporary and modern art museum in Bolzano, Italy, and it is now a meeting place for international art and an institution which is specifically dedicated for the support of the art of South Tyrol. And um, the museum collection was originally started in the early 90s and it currently uh, counts around 4,200 um, artworks. And um, the directors who have held the position over the years have individually contributed to forging the identity of this institution. Over the years, the museum has developed a specific profile by creating various themed um, areas in the collection, which is still very much a work in progress, being constantly uh, modified and added to. In the recent years, the uh, museum has consciously decided to activate its collection by the means of themed um, exhibitions that address different topics in art history and forge new dialogues with the existing artworks and between um, older pieces and new entries. The new acquisitions uh, are also designed to represent and document the exhibitions that have been held inside the museum in line with an ongoing strategy that is based on openness to the new and reviewing of the past. The new artworks that join the collection automatically introduce original ways of seeing and interpreting the older pieces. Museum uh, was founded in 1985 by the Cultural uh, Association Associazione Museum and it opened its doors in 1987 in its first venue. In 2007, it was moved uh, into its new venue, uh, which was designed by the Berlin architecture firm Kruger Schubert van Dreike. And as you can see, it is now uh, in a striking new building uh, with, that has large glass facades and that forged uh, a new dialogue be between the historical center and the new city of Bolzano. And this um, new venue opened its doors in May 2008. For a museum that sets itself the main objective of being the voice of the contemporary world, it is essential to work on the themes that most of all are involving the contemporary society. So in order to carry out an effective and sustainable protection and safeguard project, it is essential to stimulate the process of awareness of the danger and awareness of the causes that most put the cultural heritage at risk. Many of the disasters that have involved uh, works of art could have been, if not totally avoided, at least reduced in their destructive capacity if they had been preceded by a prevention and protection strategy integrated uh, into the collection management activities. For the museum, Mazzini Lab has come up with a tailor-made project 
The first phase in 2022 was dedicated to an in-depth risk assessment project of all the museum areas to try to identify all the major vulnerabilities and the most urgent threats. And this first phase lasted um, nine months and led to the drafting of a first version of the emergency plan for the museum. Subsequently, um, the second phase uh, consisted of a training course for the museum staff and a practical rescue exercise uh, carried out inside the depot. This year, in 2023, we are working on updating the emergency plan, trying to fix uh, the vulnerabilities we found in the first year of work. And we will provide a second practical exercise as soon as the second version of the emergency plan will be delivered. We knew that uh, we were working in the right direction by pursuing uh, fundamental objectives for the museum, but this has also been confirmed to us by the growing attention of the Provincia di Bolzano regarding these issues. In fact, in March 2023, the Provincia uh, team of experts drafted a um, specific manual for the creation of emergency plans for the museum of the area. In fact, for our second version of the plan, we will ensure that we respect and implement all the guidelines that are contained in that manual. So that's it for this part of this lesson. Thank you very much for your attention and we'll see you in the next part.